Hey guys, me and Alex are back and we're trying another food subscription box. And where are we this week? We're in Japan. We ordered this awesome box from Tokyo, Tokyo Treat. Treat. We ordered this. It's their premium package and it looks pretty premium, yeah. doesn't it? Before America and Australian, we can read the packets. We know what's in there. With this stuff, although there's some photos on it, we're not sure we're what not it is. Not really sure what it is. And I'm so glad we've got this little booklet because this is actually going to tell us in English what everything is. So guys, let us know if you are from Japan. Have you ever had any of these sweets or candies or snacks? Let us know down below. So if you've not watched our other candy videos, you can click that playlist and watch them there. But I think it's time to get going. Yeah, let's get going. I think we should start savory first. Yeah, I think savory starts sweet. I'm quite traditional in that way. Should we have a little search through and see what we got then? And this looks like Pringles. Got some crisps. I've seen these before, not this specific flavor or coloring, but oh, they like matcha. They're like those sticks we have, yeah. matcha. We've got, um, oh, I really don't know what that is. Oh, okay. <laughs> How about we start with these? So on the front, we've got some Japanese writing and we've got like a picture it of- It looks like a cheese fondue, don't you think? It looks like cheese fondue, but it I looks like they put marshmallow, marshmallow in. Shall I crack these open? Yes, and I'll tell you what it is. Scone rich cheese flavor, one of the most popular snacks with our subscribers. And if anyone wants to know, this is the April box, April 2017. April 2017. They kind of look like the Australian ones we had. Yeah, they look kind of like knickknacks. They smell pretty awesome. They smell look awesome. They smell a bit like fish food. Really? <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, cheers. Mmm. Oh my word. Someone's love... taken the flavor from popcorn and mixed it with a cheese crisp, haven't they? Mmm, I can see what you mean by that. Oh wow, mm. they're so crunchy. Not like a cheese crisp we have here. That is delicious. It's sweet, it's cheesy. Oh, that is so good. Mm. As our other videos, we're going to score everything out of 10. What a great start. Mm. Okay. Put them to the side, we've got a lot to try. What would you give them? I think I might give them a 10. I literally think I'm gonna start off with a 10 too. They are incredible. Let us know if this is a popular bag. Awesome. Oh, they look like the Japanese equivalent of Quavers. These are mini Carl corn puffs. Light, dashy flavor. Oh, I don't think I've ever tried dashy. What's, what's dashy? Cheers. Cheers. Ah, smells mm. like, oh, these are so nice. They're so light, aren't they? Mm. Airy. Oh, they're a bit like those onion kind of Crisps. Monster Munch. Monster Munch, they're them. I don't know what dashy is, but that's a really nice flavour. I'm going to give those a nine. I think I'm going to also give these a ten. A ten? Yeah. Mm. I'm a very crisp person. I love crisps. Mm. She's crispy. Crispetti. I think we need to make a trip to Japan. <laughs> so these look like Pringles, wouldn't you say? Yeah, I'd say so. Chipstar, one of Japan's most popular chip franchise. They released a gourmet lobster bisque flavour that satisfy even the most gourmet snackers around. Mm. They package their stuff really well. Yeah, like everything into. here is oh, so look, They are just like Pringles. Yeah. They smell like lobster. I've never had a crisp that's flavoured lobster before. Cheers. Cheers. Oh my god, it's just like lobster bisque. Yeah, so it's got a slight flavour of prawn cocktail, doesn't it? When you first put it in, or did you not think? No, just pure lobster bisque. It reminded me of being in Boston. You know, you get those bowls of lobster mm, bisque, which is like that. a bread bowl. Wow, that's literally like a meal in a crisp, isn't mm. it? I've always oh wondered god. if you could do that. These are really good. Slightly different um, crunch to Pringles, wouldn't you say? It's a bit softer. I think a better crunch, a more natural crunch. I would give that um, a 7 out of 10. Mm. I know that seems low, but... I think I'm going to go 8. Should we crack open the Coke? Yeah, I bought us some ice too. So we can uh, have a little sip So I think we need to ice way. it. So in the book it says it's the same as every other Coke, but it's the limited edition. But I did think that Coca-Cola... Tastes different in different countries. Yeah. Whoa. Ooh. I really like these aluminium tins. Yeah, they're so like you cool. You get some beers in those. It's cool. Cheers. Cheers. Do you think it's slightly lighter in taste? I don't think it's as strong. No, or is that but I don't me? know if that's because it's been traveling. I doubt that makes any difference. Never know. It tastes a bit flat. I'd say that was like a four, but the bottle itself is 
you know, that deserves a oh, 10 yeah. out of 10. <laughs> yeah. Oh my word, what are these Baskin and Robbins? Things? I don't know, that looks awesome. It's a love potion. The combination of raspberry cream and raspberry sauce covered in milk chocolate. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, that is cool. Mini packets. So it's obviously like ice cream flavor, but it's yeah. not actually ice cream. Oh, that looks so pretty in there. This is awesome. Oh, they're mini. Oh, that smells so good. <clears throat> oh, that does smell good. Cheers. Cheers, guys. Mm. Mm. We've got liquid on top. And what would you say the bottom is? Like a cream? Yeah, like a cream. Wow. That's nice. Mm. Mm. It was good, but I wouldn't like rave about it. I'd probably give it... I would. I'd give it like a five or six, I think. Probably six to be kind. I think I would give that a nine. A nine? Yeah. How much? You, you thought that was better than these crisps? What do you mean better than those crisps? Didn't you rate oh, these yeah, like an eight? Oh yeah, that's so much better than oh, those. No, you, did you do these an eight? I'm so glad there's more in there. I'll be eating those later. Or you can finish those in the office. I'm excited about that. <gasps> Oops, sorry. <laughs> they look thing? good. They're kind of... They're kind of oh, fruity. Oh, they're like gummies. As we're on fruity oh, flavour, should we go, should we for, go those? for that? Purell, Purell peach gummy using the juice of Hakuto, Hakuto white peach from Yamanashi. Sorry, Perfecture. <laughs> These gummies are bursting with juicy peach flavour. That's what I like to hear from the gummy. Enjoy the two different textures in a single gummy that'll make you think you're eating the actual fruit. Wow. How's the packet smell? You don't often get many peach Ooh, sweets, do you? Smell amazing. <gasps> and they look amazing. I think I'm going to be in heaven here. You don't get many in a packet though. Cheers. Cheers. I'm going to bite mine in half. That's really good. That's delicious. Although I thought it was going to be a liquid center. No liquid center. You have another one. Yeah. Mm. I don't know about the rest of the box, but so far everything is amazing. These literally taste like drops peach. of peach. It doesn't oh. taste artificial. It doesn't taste artificial. It must be though, mustn't it? It tastes so natural. It says here. No, no. <laughs> could you imagine if I could just read it? Oh, I just wish there were some glasses you could put on and then Ooh. see the translation. Oh, I know. No, it wasn't there Google that? Translate. Aha. Uh -huh. Maybe we found it. Aha. Uh -huh. Looking for Japanese text. I wonder if this actually works. Oh my word, we've literally got what's inside it. We should have done the front of the pack. I can't get enough of these. I know, well, don't eat the whole pack. Enjoy them later, it's because you've not had any lunch. I know. No. Time to rate, what would you say? They are really good, but I'm not sure they're better than the crisps. I do think the crisps are good. I I'm gonna go so eight. Hard. 10. 10? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we need to make our scale like a 15. Bit, yeah. yeah. I think oh, the problem is think we that... started on something so good. So good. Should we go for this? Because this looks like we have to do something. Okay, yeah. And that looks really fun. This is a chorus candy apple soft candy DIY. <laughs> I think this is better when you're younger. But for me, I like to buy food that's complete. And it's you like, can eat I don't it. want to go to a restaurant where you have to cook your own food. I like to pay for the food and the food come complete so I can eat it. Yeah, but, but I can tell you're, you're looking forward to this. Yeah. Right, DIY tutorial, let's go. Pour the apple flavored candy syrup into one of the two. <gasps> this is so cool. Okay, so we've got the candy on the stick. We've got to dip that in the um, syrup. It's very sticky. So I'm gonna dip that now in the little um, sprinkles. Spring. Springs, springs. Springs, springs. Yeah. Cheers. Anything is I can't try with you this time. No. Mm. That is so nice. It's really apple-y, it's a sour sweet, it's chewy, but it's not like too chewy. It kind mm. of you know disappears in your mouth. I not don't a biggest like, fan. no. I'm probably gonna give that a four. Four! I can see why people Gosh. would like it, but I don't like it. No, I like it, but not as much as the crisp and everything. So I'm going to give that um, a seven. This is another thing that looks cool. Should we go for this? Yeah. This is part of the premium package. Inside the box, you'll find cherry blossom influence sweets, mini figure, a piece of gum, and a diorama that can be used as a display. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't think there's actually a sweet in there. Yeah, there's a... Uh... A chewing gum. <laughs> Well, that's a bit disappointing. Gum, is that that? This is the gum. Oh, that's the gum. 
it. How cool. Should we set this up? No. Oh. So that's that. Should we try the tree? You can if you want. <laughs> no, it's okay. Yeah. Oh. We're not trying the tree again. <laughs> Like from a movie. Found it. <laughs> nothing wrong with it, but I'd probably just say, oh. Nothing wrong with it, but there's nothing right with it either. <laughs> <That's good>. so. <laughs> I'll sit that on my desk. <laughs> Moving on. I think you get a Pokemon sticker with this. Oh my word, this is so cool. That's awesome. Each pack comes with one of 24 Pokemon collectible stickers. Which one will you get? It's a it's a Charizard, isn't it? And so. it's shiny. Yeah. That looks cool though. At first I was like, uh, is it a tattoo? <laughs> you know, the colour will be hard. Maybe it is on one side. I don't remember that being a Pokemon. Look really that. good, decent sized waffle. I think any kid mm. in Japan would probably be going up to the yeah. shops going, I want that. You know, yeah. boys or girls. Or adults. It smells good. Does it? Because the chocolate's in the middle, mm. at first it tastes just a bit dry, doesn't it? Mm. When you get into it, that chocolate, the chocolate's, the chocolate's really, good, really nice. What would you give that? It hasn't like rocked my socks, so no. I'm going to like give it a seven. I'm gonna give that um, a five. Can't forget about our sticker no. in there. Ah, funny. My time So you were just saying how good the chocolate was. Yeah. Well, we've that's true. actually been sent a whole entire bar of chocolate. Classic Japanese chocolate that's been loved by many generations and continues to be the chocolate of choice for many. Wow. Cool box. I think you opened it. Yeah, and you there. get like a little tear in the corner. Oh, it's quite thin oh, though. Wow. Oh, I like the little squares. This is cool. Lottie, yeah, it said that. Ready? This is the moment. Oh, it doesn't. Oh. <laughs> it doesn't do that. This is the moment. This is still not happening. Okay, well, just take a piece. <laughs> Their pieces are tiny. Yeah, and the chocolate is really thin. Oh my word, that's the cutest little thing ever. It's a tiny box and it says Lottie. Ready? That Cheers. smells good. Yeah, really chocolatey. Mm. Mm. That kind of tastes like something here. You know when you, for Christmas, get those gold coins? Yeah. Don't you think it tastes like that? Yeah, I can see that actually. That with a mixture of lint, with a mixture of... Um, m and chocolate. Yeah. yeah. That is so much better than American chocolate. I'm going to go seven, because that was pretty And good. I'm going to go seven and a half. Ooh, I think that's pretty good. good. Now these look smart. This, this is, is so packing. classy. Now I've seen this make here, uh, Pokey or Pocky, however you say it. We're sure that this special rich matcha flavour will tantalise the taste buds of all lovers of green tea. Matcha. Wow! You get two packs. These are cool. So these are kind of like Mikados over here in England. Mm. It's like a biscuit with a chocolate on the end. This case being a matcha. A really thin biscuit. They're kind of it's like, almost like a wafery biscuit. Almost like it? a lightsaber. Do, 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 do. Cheers. Cheers. I don't know what it's going to taste like. Oh, it does taste like tea. I'm literally eating a tea bag. Really get that tea bag kind of flavour. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of like I've literally got a tea bag. Is that what they all these matcha bag. things taste like? I think so. It's like I'm putting a soggy tea bag in <laughs> biscuit form in my mouth. Biscuit's nice. I can taste the white chocolate coming through. But then, yeah, it's tea bag. Literally, like that cold tea bag in your mouth. Not very nice. What do you say? I'm gonna give that a five. I'm gonna give that a four. This is a honey soy sauce rice cracker. This rice cracker has been fried to perfection. Ooh. Cheers, it kind of Cheers. looks like a prawn cracker more it like does, a doesn't. rice cracker. Hmm. Kind of sweet. Yeah, it's sweet. But then the more you eat into it, it's savoury. It's honey. That's a bit weird. I thought more of the stuff in this box was gonna be more weird like this. It's not my favourite. I would probably give that a three. I think this is better than the matcha, so I'd give this a six, probably. I'm going to eat this bit because actually it's quite moorish. Cheeky. And the final thing in the box before we get to the little snack bag, um, a kind of something that looks like poppets over here. Is that mm. what they used to be called? Caramel choco ball. Oh, yeah. I like that. Mmm, it is chewy. Mm. I thought it was going to be really hard. Really nice. It feels like you get quite a lot in there, so worth it. I'll give that a seven. I can't remember really what I scored no. on the thing, so I'm going to go eight, because I think they're really good. Yeah, they're really good. I oh. think they'd fit perfectly in there. Yeah. Save them for later. Now, I think we're going to be in trouble here, because everything else has had an English explanation. What, so they just put any random things in here that Yeah, got? that's a dagashi. I wonder if we're saying all this right. Do you know what dagashi means? No. Cheap sweets. <laughs> 
and my eyebow is horse wart. I hope not. They smell pretty good. Do they? They're kind they, of like They look like little balls. roast potatoes, don't they? Oh my word, yes they do. Oh wow. Yum. Wow. Mm. It's got a pickled onion kind of taste to it. Oh yeah. They are delicious. Might have one more. I think they have to be up there with these ones. Mm. I think I'm going to have to give them a 10. I don't think I like them as much as those ones. I'm going to give them an 8. This box has been great for this me. This has been really good. This hasn't has been it? really good. Look at these. What are they? Pancakes. Like greaseproof paper. What is that? Looks like inside of a sports bra. <laughs> well, I don't often wear sports bras, so. Oh my god, they're so thin. Looks like the padding of my sports bra. But in front, there's something here, Al. I reckon it Ooh, just wow. literally tastes like paper. What colour is it? It's brown. I it's like brown. soy, but like thicker. Like thicker, more of a sauce. Are you going... Was that a bad decision? No, it's a fine decision. <laughs> It'll just be better with this. <laughs> mm. Oh, that's well, it's kind of sweet. sweet. That's like just, you know, like the wafer before, but like just one layer of it. It's like having a sweet wafer with gravy, isn't it? <gasps> that's weird, isn't it? The aftertaste is kind of like the paper you used to be able to eat. Oh yeah, the rice paper. Without being too harsh, I'll give it a two. A two? Yeah. I didn't think it was that a bad. Two. Okay. A two! A large? <laughs> a large. A large! You got your money! He got money! Get it all for him. I'm gonna give that a five. Look at the packet for that. These are really cool. Oh. Oh wow! It's like we don't have it. It's like a massive crisp. We don't have anything Ooh, like that here. That. Really pizza -y. Yeah. Oh, Do you want to have first? first bite? There you go. No, it's had your nose on it now. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, that's a bit like that rice cracker. I think it's one of the weirdest things I've ever seen, but a great idea, don't yeah. you think? Because it's not like a bag of crisps, and then it's not, it's like but a- It's like a bit overly strong on the kind of herby really, side of things. I'll probably give that a two. I'll give that a seven. <laughs> a two? Yeah. You think that's as bad as that? Yes. <laughs> ah! Oh. What is it? Is it kind of like biscuity? On the easy side. Hmm. Really soft, isn't it? A bit like a lady finger, but less dry. Yeah. I'm going to drop that a uh, six. I'm going to drop that a four. I think the pizza thing was better than that. I can't believe it. We've got one thing left to try. Oh, it's so soft. Cheers. Cheers. I wonder what flavour. That's a shame. What did you think of that? It's kind of like almost not sweet. It is sweet, but it's kind of like so powdery that yeah. you're not sure if it's actually sweet well, or not. Well, I really like these. I just wish there was a bit more flavour. I think that might just be vanilla. Thank goodness they wrote do not eat in English, otherwise we'd be like, what is that? I don't think I would have eaten that. I think I, I, think I know enough about um, those little dry silica packs that I wouldn't have eaten that. It's a good job I'm here. I'll give that a six and a half. Now I'm gonna do a cake and I'm gonna give that a three. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's it. Look at the mess so that's all the candy. What a mess. That was so good. I, I thought it was going to be really weird, a bit off the wall, but, but actually, actually, it was so good. So guys, let us know if you've tried any of these sweets or snacks before, and also let us know which country you'd like us to try sweets and snacks from next. So that is the end of the video. If you haven't checked out our other subscription boxes yet, click the link above and you can watch those. But yeah, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye. Bye.